Ever wondered about the secrets that the landlocked nation of Laos holds? Nestled in the heart of Southeast Asia, Laos is a country that brims with intrigue and charm. Bordered by China to the north, Vietnam to the east, Cambodia to the southeast, Thailand to the west, and Myanmar to the northwest, Laos is a realm of staggering natural beauty and cultural complexity. A land where emerald rice fields blend seamlessly with the horizon, where majestic mountains reach for the sky, where the mighty Mekong River courses through, carving its way through spectacular landscapes. But it's not just the geographical allure that sets Laos apart. This is a nation where tradition reigns supreme, where every woven silk thread, every meticulously sculpted temple, every hearty bowl of noodle soup tells a tale of a rich and diverse culture steeped in centuries of history. So, strap in as we embark on a journey to uncover fascinating facts about Laos. Did you know Laos was once known as the land of a million elephants? Indeed, the majestic elephant has been an integral part of Lao culture for centuries. For the Laotians, these magnificent creatures symbolize strength, power and longevity. The historical significance of elephants in Laos is truly remarkable. They were not only used in royal processions, acting as bearers of kings and princes, but also played a crucial role in warfare, demonstrating the might of the Lao Armada. The elephant's strength and resilience became synonymous with the spirit of the people of Laos. In addition to their roles in royalty and warfare, elephants were also essential in agriculture. They were the powerhouses of farming, assisting in tasks such as plowing fields and transporting heavy loads. Their contribution to the socio-economic fabric of Laos is monumental. From royal processions to farming, elephants have played a pivotal role in Lao history. They are not merely animals, but symbols of the nation's rich and enduring heritage. Buddhism isn't just a religion in Laos, it's a way of life. This statement resonates deeply with the essence of this Southeast Asian nation. Buddhism is so intricately woven into the cultural, architectural and daily life fabric of Laos that it's almost impossible to separate the two. Buddhism in Laos is of the Theravada tradition, which emphasizes personal spiritual growth and the quest for enlightenment. This path to inner peace and harmony is reflected in the tranquil demeanor of the Lao people, who are known for their patience, kindness and respect for all living beings. Buddhist teachings also influence Lao culture in many ways. For instance, the concept of karma, the belief in the consequences of one's actions, guides the moral compass of the Lao people. This belief in doing good deeds to accumulate merit for a better next life is deeply entrenched in the Lao society. The impact of Buddhism extends beyond the personal and cultural spheres and is also evident in the country's architecture. The landscape of Laos is dotted with thousands of Buddhist temples or wats, each a marvel of traditional Lao design. These wats are not just places of worship, but they also serve as community centers where festivals, ceremonies and social events take place. Monks clad in their distinctive saffron robes are a common sight throughout Laos. The tradition of male Lao Buddhists becoming monks, even if only for a short period, is a significant aspect of Lao life. It's seen as a rite of passage, a way to gain merit for themselves and their families, and an opportunity for education. Moreover, the daily alms-giving ritual, where locals offer food to monks on their morning alms rounds, is a poignant symbol of the symbiotic relationship between the monastic and lay communities. It's a daily reminder of the Buddhist principles of humility, simplicity and compassion. In Laos, Buddhism permeates every aspect of life, shaping the nation's identity. It's not just a religion, it's a philosophy, a guide, a tradition and a way of life. It's a beautiful testament to how spirituality can shape a nation's culture and character, making Laos a truly unique and fascinating destination. Laos holds a less fortunate record, the most bombed country per capita in history. This is a stark reality that has its roots in the Vietnam War era. From 1964 to 1973, a staggering 2 million tons of ordnance was dropped on Laos, making the country a silent victim of a conflict it was never officially part of. The bombings were part of a covert operation by the United States aimed at disrupting the supply routes of the North Vietnamese. Now, let's delve into the unexploded ordnance or UXO issue that Laos grapples with even today. You see, not all bombs explode upon impact. It's estimated that around 30% of the ordnance dropped did not detonate, lying dormant and posing a deadly threat to unsuspecting civilians. 
These unexploded bombs have caused over 20,000 casualties since the end of the war, with one third of these being children who often mistake the small, ball-shaped cluster bombs for toys. The impact of these UXOs goes beyond the immediate danger they present. They have also hindered economic development and infrastructure growth. Large areas of land are deemed unsafe due to the presence of UXOs, limiting agricultural activities and the construction of roads, schools and hospitals. But it's not all doom and gloom. Over the years, concerted efforts have been made to address this lingering issue. Local and international organizations are working tirelessly to clear the land of these hazardous remnants. These demining operations are meticulous and dangerous, but they have made significant progress. It's a slow process, but one that is gradually transforming the lives of the Laotian people. Additionally, education programs have been implemented to raise awareness about the dangers of UXOs, particularly among children. This has contributed to a significant decrease in UXO-related accidents in recent years. The UXO issue is a grim reminder of Laos's past, but the nation continues to heal and progress. The resilience of the Laotian people, their determination to overcome this tragic legacy, is a testament to the indomitable spirit of this fascinating country. The Mekong River isn't just a water body in Laos, it's the lifeblood of the nation. Flowing with a majestic grace, the Mekong River is a lifeline for the people of Laos. It is a constant presence, winding its way through the heart of the country, its waters nurturing the land and the people who live along its banks. This mighty river serves as a major highway not just for Laos but for the entire Mekong region. From the remote highlands to the bustling cities, the Mekong River is a bustling waterway, teeming with long-tail boats, floating markets and fishing vessels. It's a river highway where goods are transported and livelihoods are made. Trade along the Mekong is a lifeblood for many Laotians. The river provides a lifeline to isolated communities, allowing them to trade their goods with the outside world. It's a bustling trade route where you'll find everything from fresh produce and fish to handmade crafts and textiles. But the Mekong's significance extends beyond transportation and trade. The river is the lifeblood of agriculture in Laos. Its fertile plains provide the perfect environment for rice cultivation, the staple food of the country. As the river swells with the monsoon rains, it irrigates the paddy fields, ensuring a rich harvest. And let's not forget the cultural significance of the Mekong. The river is deeply intertwined with Laotian rituals and traditions. It's the site of the annual boat racing festival, a thrilling spectacle that brings together communities in a celebration of strength, skill and teamwork. The Mekong is also the setting for the endearing ritual of releasing lanterns, a sight to behold as hundreds of glowing orbs float down the river, carrying prayers and wishes. So you see, the Mekong River is more than just a river. It's a symbol of life, a provider, a highway, a marketplace, a field for cultivation and a stage for cultural rituals. The Mekong River, with its ceaseless flow, mirrors the resilient spirit of the Laotians, always moving forward no matter the obstacles. The Mekong River, a symbol of life and prosperity, truly captures the spirit of Laos. In Laos, there's always a reason to celebrate. Envision a land where the calendar teems with celebrations, where each month brings with it a festival that reverberates with joy and cultural richness. Yes, we're talking about Laos, a country that truly lives up to its name as the land of festivals. An integral part of the Laotian way of life, these festivals illuminate the country's profound cultural tapestry. They're not merely about merriment, but serve as a tangible connection to the past, a vibrant display of age-old traditions and a testament to the country's unity and harmony. Let's embark on a journey through the year, witnessing the festive spirit that thrives in Laos, beginning with the Bun Pi Mai, the Laotian New Year celebrated in mid-April. It's a time for purification and renewal where Buddha images are cleansed with perfumed water and the streets come alive with parades and water fights. Then we have the Boonbang FAIA, the Rocket Festival, an explosive celebration aimed at prompting the heavens to send rain for the upcoming rice planting season. Villagers construct homemade rockets and launch them skyward, combining competition with communal celebration. As we move into the fall, we come across Bunok Phansa, marking the end of Buddhist Lent. 
This vibrant festival is characterized by the Lai Hua Fai Ai, or the Festival of the Fireboats, where beautifully decorated boats adorned with candles and offerings are set afloat on the Mekong River, creating a mesmerizing spectacle of light. And let's not forget the Bun That Luang, held in Vientiane, which is considered the most significant religious festival in Laos. Thousands converge at the That Luang Stupa to pay homage, participate in candlelight processions, and revel in traditional music and dance. These are just a few snapshots of the myriad festivals celebrated in Laos. Each one, with its unique rituals and traditions, brings together communities, fostering a sense of togetherness and shared heritage. Festivals in Laos are a vibrant display of the nation's rich culture and communal spirit,